Okay, so I'm at Value Village right now. I just got my McDonald's stuff. And uh, the guy who gave me my food, well, no, the guy that I gave money to, well, like I paid, oh, he was so cute. He was like white and tanned and dirty blonde. <laughs> Um, but he looked young. He looked maybe like 18 or 19, probably over 18 because it's school hours right now and he's not in school. I mean, he's working at McDonald's and, you know, at least my man got a job. Well, actually, he's not my man, but I actually could never be my man because it's such a huge age difference. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. 18 and 19, yeah, that's way too young for me. I mean, maybe just for a casual hookup, but not like, you know, anything serious. I like to stay in and play board games. He probably likes to go out at night and get drunk. I like to go shopping for like, you know, food and clothes and bags. He probably likes to go skateboarding with his friends. No, it ain't gonna work. <laughs> I like to travel. He probably likes to go and like hang out at the mall. I don't know. That's just what I'm thinking. I don't know how teens think anymore. It's been too long. Actually, it's not even that long. It's like 1999, 2000. But I don't know. I wonder like sometimes like if grandmas think like that. Do grandmas ever like, like say you're a grandma, say you're like 78 and then you see like a cute young like 19 year old. Do you ever think of them sexually or do you think that's just way too young for you even though it's like legal? Or even like 78 and like you see a hot 22 year old. That's way legal already. But I wonder how grandmas think that way. Let me know if you're a grandma and you think that way. So we found this Armani exchange top for $4.99 and it's 50% off. I don't know if I want to get it though. I'm not 100% sure. It's cute though. I don't know. We'll, we'll, we'll do a maybe on that one. There's a Hollister. They have these Columbia shoes that are really cute for my brother perfect for the winter but they're kind of pricey at $35 and it's not 50% off the shoes I might come back for those tomorrow and use my mom's discount I don't know yet though So I found this Rock and Republic large, kind of slouchy blouse. $6.99 minus 50%. I don't know though. Made out of rayon. Made in Indonesia. I don't know. Looks cute. Put it in the maybe pile. We'll see how much those sell on eBay for. Okay, it was such an utter disappointment. I mean, I did buy two shirts for my sister for 50% off, but other than that, I couldn't find anything high-end. I didn't find any purses. I didn't find any accessories. I didn't find shit, basically. <laughs> I didn't find shoes. Really nothing. I mean, my value village by my house has kind of been lacking in that department lately but I just don't have the energy to go to a different value village at the moment I haven't slept much and yeah who's a stupid idiot parking in my spot yeah I haven't I don't have the energy to to go to a different value village right now I went to bed late. I was watching The Exorcist, the new TV show based on the movie. It was really good, actually. So that's kind of why. And Z Nation, I was watching Z Nation because I didn't finish last season of Z Nation and there's a new season that started, so I'm trying to finish that. Um, but yeah, so I didn't really get anything except for, I'll show you. I paid $7 for both these shirts. Um, they're both for my sister. I got her this uh, uh, Smurf shirt. 
don't know if you can see that. I'll put it over here. I got her this Smurf shirt in pink and then this Abercrombie and Fitch shirt in uh, pink as well, like a different color shade of pink. So I got her both of these. Abercrombie is an expensive brand, so paying only $4.50 for it is a deal and a half. I think, and this is a cute shirt. This is like really cute. I'm trying to see how I can show you guys. That's not gonna work. <laughs> anyway, it's a cute shirt. Two ninety two Fitch on the front, and it's pink. And that's the label. Anyway, I'm going to try again tomorrow thrifting and see if I can find anything and use my mom's 30% off coupon. So, yeah, we'll try again tomorrow. So I just looked on eBay and these blouses, like Rockin' Republic, usually you only sell for like $20. So it's not really worth it even with the 50% because it'd still be $350. Uh, we'll put it back. Oh, Jennifer Lopez. <laughs> so here is the bags that I see off the bat. I think that's a fake MK. I'm not going to get that one. And, but I'll look at the MK regardless. I don't know what the other one is over there. I think it's a coach. We'll see. These are really cute Dabney leather for $49. There's not much wear on it except for like some loose stitching that I can actually just trim off. So that's kind of cute. Yeah. And there's a little bit of wear on the glazing of the corners. So I think I'm going to pass on that. So we're just going to go with the lug bag. So I just finished scanning like five racks of clothes, usually size medium because high-end designers usually have their clothes uh, sized in smaller medium and I didn't really find any high-end clothing, like absolutely nothing. And this is like the rich white folk area. So either I was beat to the punch or they just don't have anything. So yeah, clothes wise, nothing. You always see me. <laughs> I always see you. First time I see you. Oh. Oh, kiddo. Can I see the lap? Well, I don't know. I think it's missing a hood. Well, it's a hood. Do you have a hood? Yeah. 
There is no discount for a new item. Oh, okay there. Thirty-nine minus thirty percent. Hundred thirty-nine forty-five. Is that what the discount? Yeah. Contract's gonna be in your email. Contract's gonna be in your email. There, you're good to go. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Just got the iPhone. Hey guys, let's go to Dollarama. Well, Dollar Tree technically, and we'll see what we can find here. Sorry if the camera's shaky. It's just when I walk, I'm big, so the camera shakes. It's kind of a given. I'm trying to find a new case for my iPhone 6 Plus because the case on it doesn't work too well. It has like a sticky back. I ordered it from Facebook and it's like so crappy. Ooh, I wonder what these smell like. This actually smells pretty good. Island Escape. Should I? Shouldn't I? I still have a lot of Bath & Body Works candles so let's not. Here's the cases. Now which one? Is this one out? That no, that won't fit. Oh, this will fit six plus. I don't like that color though. Oh, they have other ones. Okay. They just have like basic ones. Oh, I have a black one. Let's get a black one, maybe. Black. Let's see what it looks like. I don't know if I like this plain black. Yeah, this one is cute. I don't know. It just feels kind of cheap. I don't know. Might as well just use what I have. They have it in purple, so I think I'm just going to go with the purple one. Just so it has some added protection, you know? I should get one of these for my iPad mini. a lot of cleaning supplies. Food aisle. <coughs> oh, no problem.
need to buy floss picks. Flo Ooh, here we go. I haven't flossed in a while. I know it's bad, but. Jenny, to the it front, please. It is what it is. I don't have a lot of brand names like this. A dollar tree, like dollar ram it is, but it's also everything is a dollar twenty-five here, so everything is more cheaper. Did I go down this aisle already? I think I did. I'm trying to look for underwear. Not for me, for my brothers. I guess we'll get some Coke. The kind you drink, not the kind you sniff. Um, actually, I've been kind of craving. Oh, they have Coke Life. What's that all about? Never heard of Coke Life before. Ooh, sweetened from natural sources. I guess I'll get two because I've never had these before. And maybe like a apple juice. Let me know. Do I need batteries? I can't remember if I needed batteries. Hmm. Oh, they have bait. Can you build bait? Ooh, and bait. I guess this is new. I guess it's less fat. I love the ketchup chips. You should try. I know they don't have this in the U.S., but we'll try the creamy dill and ketchup. Do they have barbecue? No, they don't. Just ketchup and creamy dill. Well, we'll try the ketchup. We got some batteries too. I always run out of batteries. I like to stock up on these. It was eleven dollars, which I think is a good deal. Okay. I got a lot of things for eleven dollars. This mall is so. I'm glad they're expanding the mall over there. They're opening a, a Filipino restaurant called Jollibee, which is like the McDonald's of the Philippines. So that's good, and they're opening something else over there where the where they're 
where there was previously a parking lot. Anyway guys, thanks for coming with me until my next video. Remember, Miss Philly loves you. Bye!